Hi everyone, welcome to another TOS video. In this video, I'll be playing the terror stage Raging of Ancient Gods using a Namtar team. I'll give you tips and tricks along the way, so let's begin. Hey, first battle we have two nymphs. Um, so here I'm going to just spin normally and gather up my Gemini multiplier. They have a pretty significant amount of HP so you can do a normal spin and you will still have one of them alive. Again, gather up Gemini multiplier. And you want to slightly heal up before the next battle. Otherwise, you'll be killed by the initial ambush attack. Next we have Ninurta with 4 burn positions, ambush attack, and we can Fire and earth damage. So fire and earth damage we don't care about since we're playing a mono dark team. And we also don't care about the burn runes because we're running a VR Babylon team and it ignores the effect of burn runes on us. So here I just finished accumulating my Gemini multiplier and take him out. Then I activate Hell. And I also activate Ludomping to get rid of all the fire runes on the board because a fire combo will nullify your attack. This way we can take him out in one shot. Sometimes he survives with a little bit so then just do a full attack or just stack your fire runes and then attack. Here we have 3 guards, 2 with first blood shield and here it is very important that you do a full attack in order to get rid of the 2 enemies on the sides. Otherwise if you only kill one, the middle one will still do 100% HP reduction and kill you even if there's another enemy on the board. Here I'm going to activate Osiris to increase my attack since the enemy has 50 times defense. So this is just a small secu security measure that I use to guarantee the kill on this enemy. Next we have Namtar with 20% tumbler shield and 70% poison. So here thanks to hell we can reliably recover health every turn with dark runes. So here we're just going to take 5 rounds to take Namtar out. Uh, for the craft that I'm bringing for this stage, I'm bringing a CD delay craft uh, which will come into play at the boss stage. Yeah, Namtar's first HP bar is pretty straightforward using Hell since we can just hit him hard and not worry about healing since we get so many Dark Runes dropping uh, thanks to VR Babylon skill. Cool. Next we have the second HP bar which is Sticky Dark Runes. But again, VR Babylon doesn't care about sticky or burn runes, so we can just spin normally and take him out in two to three turns. Mm. 
Next we have Battle 5 Atrahasis with Time Down Debuff, Initial Attack, and Weakened Water Runes. Here I activate Ritomping and I activate Namtar Time Tunnel to bypass the Time Down Debuff that we have. Next we have Anu with initial 6 combo shield, um, neutralized reset, and a skull. So here I'm going to activate Namtar. Yeah. Yeah, activate Namtar. And use his time tunnel to get uh, 6 or more combos. Uh, 6 combos exactly. And this is going to be enough damage to kill him in one shot. Notice how I didn't use my craft. This is because his second HP bar will attack you the lower the HP, the more times it attacks. And two attacks will kill you. So here I activate Osiris. And I also activate my craft here. If you activate craft before this stage, he will still go back to CD1 regardless. So it's very important that you activate craft here instead. Um, yeah, because when he has HP above 50%, he will survive your hit and he will still attack you. So we're going to delay him for two rounds so that he will die the second round. Yeah. When HP is greater than 50%, he survives with one HP. And since he is now delayed for two rounds, we can just go ahead and take him out really easily. You don't necessarily have to bring this craft that delayed him for two rounds. Even delaying him for one round is enough. Oh, next we have the seventh battle. Just do a normal spin and take the PR material out. Yeah, overall I think this is a pretty stable team using the strategy that I just showed you and it's pretty reliable to beat this terror stage. I hope you enjoyed this video, stay tuned for more TOS videos on my channel and I will see you next time, bye bye!